So I'm, first of all, happy to be joined by a superstar in public life. Uh, she comes to Albany with this depth of passion for her beliefs that is just so inspiring to all of us in government. And I could also go out in the streets, take it to the streets, go out in the streets, take it to the streets, take it to the streets. And she could also go out in the streets, take it to the streets, go where people are, and let them know they can have a different outcome in life. How you all come from different experiences, but you all came here for a common purpose. And in some of your cases, your common purpose may be to stop others from having the experience you had, right? You, say, you don't have to do this. This is not your destiny. It's not preordained that when you grow up on a block or in a neighborhood, that this is where you're going to end up. So it is that power in those stories and those personal connections that only you can give to people that I can. Go out in the streets. Take it to the streets. Go out in the streets. Take it to the streets. Take it to the streets. Also go out in the streets. Take it to the streets. Go where people are and let them know they can have a different outcome in life. If I have any talent, it's a talent for picking the best people. All right, would you, would you agree with that? Okay, okay. So her experience working with New York City, going from 6 to 22 uh, facilities and ramping them up and saying, this is how we're going to make a difference. You know, we can't be sitting in an office downtown thinking about these problems and, you know, maybe throwing money here or there. we got to get to the streets. we got to set up organizations where people live. So I want to thank you for being uh, so one of the early pioneers of this effort, but now we harness your talents. So out in the streets, take it to the streets, go out in the